Welcome Gemini to your November bonus love reading. If you are new to my channel, welcome to Charlie Tarot and feel free to subscribe. So if you are new here, how we do things is we're going to use this deck, which is called the AF Tarot deck to pull some energies, do some tarot. At the end of the reading, we are going to pull the lovers of oracles. I also am going to use the hidden truth messages from your person and messages of love. And at the end of the reading, again, we are going to pull some more oracles for you. So let's go ahead and get started with your reading and see what is coming in for you guys. All right, Gemini, let's see. Ooh, I love it. We have the Four of Rings and the Will coming in. Okay. We have the Nine of Wands energy. Bottom of the deck is the Ace of Rings. Oh, wow. And the Ten of Cups. And then we have a Cancer Scorpio Pisces coming in. Okay. And keep in mind, this reading may not resonate with every single one of you, so please take what resonates with you and leave the rest behind. We have the Queen of Wands coming in your energy, the High Priestess, the Justice card, and the Seven of Wands. We have the Two of Wands, the Ten of Swords, the Hierophant, Ooh, and then we have the Emperor energy, three of cups and the five of swords and the four of swords on the bottom of the deck all right gemini i do feel like you are building your confidence here with this three of cups and the five of swords energy okay this could be experiencing some some type of loss are feeling defeated within the situation. We do have the challenge of someone not taking responsibility of their own actions, and I do feel that is a big situation here, a big problem, because it's like the it could be you know choices or a divorce here or something with contract, but it's all about bringing something to balance. And with this justice card, it is stating that there's a lot of imbalance and some dishonesty here where someone is, you know, there's consequences that come with this justice card, right? So it's more of a karmic justice is in play. Um, and it's all due to this person, okay? So there's a lot of truth and wisdom that comes with this whole situation as you are gaining your strength back here with the five of swords. I feel like you are becoming more evade, um, more motivated within the situation as you are apart with this person. This could be a separation here and kind of like looking back at how far you've come um, and how much pain this has caused you. So I feel like the will is here to move in your favor and the four of rings is more of like still holding on to something, but also in the process of letting go. Like this situation definitely tested your strength, but you persevered through this. And I feel like this this new cycle or this new beginning here, or this big change that is happening is bringing in these new beginnings, okay? The Ace of Rings is all about new opportunities, stable opportunities, and the Ten of Cups is this path that is bringing in your happily ever after, right? Happiness, abundance here, joy, laughter, family, and it's all for the stability of your life. So I'm loving this. This is awesome. It's a huge opportunity here, and it all has to do with a choice. Now, somebody, some of you guys could be feeling as you're in a crossroads right now, but I do feel like this person it could be at the Ten of Swords energy as you're more moving towards this direction. Um, again, they could be feeling a lot of regret and feeling like this painful ending is occurring, but I do feel like you are standing in your power and following your intuition and the spirituality as you don't see coming is the Hierophant. Again, the Hierophant is all about your beliefs, your rooted faith here, okay? So this is showing that there's like um, uh, following your truth of your divine path, okay? So I'm loving this and releasing what no longer serves you. 
And in the outcome, we do have the emperor energy. Now, this is all about taking your power back. This is more of that energy of a natural leader. It's all about structure um, and critical thinking, right? And analytical thinking. And um, it's all about having the confidence and being passionate for what you do and building something great. Now, this could be with somebody completely new. This could be on your own, but it's a rising above this whole situation. All right, so let's go ahead and grab a, a couple cards on how this person feels about you. All right, let's see. How does this person feel about Gemini? I feel so drawn to you. Oh, you inspire me. <laughs> and I don't know what you want. I still feel the pain. Yeah, there's somebody here that is still, you know, that Ten of Swords energy. This is feeling a lot of regret here. Yeah, you see, it says regret. Yeah, someone feels remorse for the way they treated you. Um, I feel like this is a big realization for this person here, or maybe this could have been the past, present, or something you're coming out of. But either way, there's abundance and beautiful things like happily ever after here, and it's bringing in a lot of change. And I feel like you are like this tested again, your strength here. Wow. Big message there for a Gemini because it does feel look at, yeah, firm boundaries are needed now. That's what you're doing. That nine of wands is more of setting boundaries, having your walls up and again, standing your ground here. So if you are planning to take this person back, it's more of, you know, it's not going to be on their terms. They're needing responsi taking responsibility. But I do feel like for uh, others of you, we do have something uh, coming in. Oh, we have a marriage. This relationship is moving toward a sacred union. It is safe to make the move you're considering. Okay, now take what resonates with these messages. But that could be for some of you guys. Now, let's go ahead and pull the lover. Oh, okay. The lovers of oracles just shuffle them a little more you may not always understand why certain things happen however there's always a higher purpose to the events in your life through turmoil a blessing will soon be revealed yeah and that's what that hair fin that's what it comes with okay it comes with um blessings and wish fulfillment and it's all because you're going down the best path for you and then it says wait don't rush into it allow nature to take its course very big messages there and it says look deep within your heart and you will feel my love my love for you is as deep as the ocean that could be how someone feels about you as we have this Ten of Cups energy. Now, again, take what resonates with these readings, but it does look like a separation is here. A lot of heartbreak that was involved and somebody's feeling a lot of regret as something could be ending and more moving into a new direction, more of what makes Gemini happy with this Hierophant. And then we have the Emperor, okay? So there's a couple messages here for you guys. I am gonna go ahead and leave it here if you guys do like this reading. Or if it helped in any way, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys very soon. God bless.